Thursday, April 29th. I am out for a walk today instead of my normal lunch run because uh, I'm tapering. A little bit of a surprise taper. But I registered yesterday for a race that is Saturday this weekend. It's one that I'd been uh, thinking about for a while. Heard about it actually on a podcast where the race director was interviewed and then had a running friend comment that she was gonna run it and that's still the deal. So one that I'm really looking forward to and is really unique. I'm running the Great Southern Endurance Race 100K and this is a really unique race because it's uh, really a um, urban navigating tour of the city of Atlanta and I'm pretty excited about it. I'm excited to see the sights of Atlanta. I'm excited to try my hand at uh, urban navigating. Uh, I'm excited to, uh, to see what the day holds. Good morning. It's about 4.30. We're hiking to the top of Kennesaw Mountain for the start of the Great Southern Endurance Race. We've entered the Chattahoochee National Recreation Area. First trails of the run. It's a beautiful area. Hard to believe you're in a city. Haven't explored this part before. It's neat to see. Right, we are just over 13 miles in. I'm just finishing up a goo. I've had a uh, banana and some bacon as well. This is the espresso flavor. First time I've tried it. I am a no goo expert, but I like this one better than most. And we are currently running along the Chattahoochee River. Got my navigation turn sheets here, the lanyard, carabiner. Figuring out what the next turn is coming up. Full transparency, a little bit lost, but we expected this. And uh, checking the maps, looks like we're just about back on course. We're at uh, 17 miles, just went through an aid station. Uh, pretty minimum as far as ultras go but got everything you need and uh, the nicest people out here which is pretty common of course for the folks at ultras and picked up a fig bar some water and i believe that's our next destination if you can see it truest park home of the braves fig bar We hit the Truist Park, 17.7 miles. 
This is where the Braves play. Uh, pretty new. It's the closest I've ever been to it. Uh, not much of a baseball or, or sports fan, but uh, that's where they uh, that's where they hit balls and such. We are uh, 19 and a half miles in, and now we are on the Bob Callen Trail. We'll leave heading towards uh, Rotwood. That's what I read. I haven't seen any of these trails, so loving exploring all that Atlanta has to offer. Chattahoochee, about 22 miles in, take another gel, a little bit bigger one, a spring energy speed nut. 23 miles in, just leaving an aid station, got some uh, Mountain Dew, some water, put some noon in it, got a uh, Pop-Tart Bites, had an orange, and we're ready to go again. Stop by the Circle K at uh, Piedmont and Far. Got a, uh, oops, water, Gatorade, Snickers. Uh, very nice bathrooms, highly recommend it. All right, we'll get back on the road. Update on the snack situation. Snickers peanut butter brownie. No, peanut brownie. It's good stuff. Famous King of Pops. Got a uh, blackberry ginger lemonade. Let's see how it is. Yeah, that hits a spot. Georgia Capitol Building. Found a uh, random beer garden on tap and uh, taking a short break. Hello. All right. Just went through the Oakwood Cemetery aid station got a mm, I see I had two bananas an orange a cup of coke and grabbed some nutter butters for the road so we are back at it we are currently in cabbage town and making our way towards stone mountain
43 miles in. You know, I'm tired. I guess it should be 43 miles. Uh, it's hot, but I guess it should be in Georgia in May. So, you know, all things considered, it's going about as expected. And uh, just seeing all the sights. We're in the Rindman Park right now. Looking forward to seeing what's next. Another spring energy speed nut. Well, I guess it's high time that I introduce you to my running buddy, Azam. We've spent just about all of our miles together today. Hello, YouTube world. Azam's from New York. Yep, Brooklyn. He's the real deal. I think he's got as many 100 mile finishes as I have ultra finishes. I wouldn't say that, but. And uh, he's got a, a big year ahead of him. What you got planned? Well, I think I'm gonna try to go for a Grand Slam and see if I can uh, make it happen this year. Awesome, for those that, that don't know, what's the Grand Slam of ultras? Uh, so it was going to be Western States, Vermont, uh, Leadville and Wasatch. But now that Vermont is canceled, I think they're gonna allow us to use Old Dominion as a substitute. Excellent, wow, that's incredible. So you've gotten into Western States? That's correct. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. And now today, how are you, uh, how are you feeling about today's race? Uh, not too bad, I guess, all things considered. Uh, legs a little beat up, but uh, all in all, I think it's a pretty decent day. He might be painting a little rosy picture. <laughs> I think so too. Now it has been a really neat adventure for sure. And oh, we've yes. had a good time, but, Absolutely. Uh, but it is a little bit of a low spot at the moment. It is. It's yeah. tough. This is, yeah. uh, you know, sort of the, the last third. It's, uh, it's not yeah. easy. Yeah. It's getting, it's getting harder cause I'm getting more tired and yeah. it's getting hotter and, uh, it's a lot of, uh, miles on pavement. Uh, that's no, right. Neither of us do a whole lot. Nope. So yeah, that definitely makes a difference. It's warm uh, and uh, and aid's been a little uh, sparser than we expected. Mm -hmm. yes. We expected more uh, gas stations. We knew it would be uh, a lot of it being uh, sort of self-supported mm -hmm. uh, for a lot. Uh, we expected that, yep. but it hasn't been a lot of places to, to choose from. Yeah. So in uh, big stretches between their aid stations, but mm -hmm. but I guess that's part of it. Yeah, that's, I guess so. You learn, you, uh, you adapt. Yep, you, you manage. You overcome, yep. Absolutely. All right, we're gonna keep uh, keep on keeping on. Peace. Feeding pretty good here a little bit. We've still got about three miles to the next aid station. So I'm gonna pull out uh, a little secret weapon I like to bring. This is a chocolate milk, uh, not dairy product though. This has been on me the whole time. Uh, either soy or almond. Soy I think has the uh, the most uh, sugar which is that quick energy you need. But other than that, it's got lots of good stuff, uh, specifically uh, magnesium and, uh, and potassium. So uh, a little bit of uh, sodium as well, some protein. That's so uh, it's pretty, pretty stout, lots of calories, uh, 170 in this bottle, and it uh, goes down pretty easy. They're pretty good. Soy uh, silk chocolate. Back at the last aid station, I had a uh, uncrustable peanut butter and jelly. I filled my water, uh, another bottle with a noon tablet. Got ice in both and uh, got a cup of Coke and packed out some oranges. And we're gonna have that now. Stopped by a gas station for some aid. Got a cold drink. Got a Sprite. Look at this. <clears throat> 38 grams of sugar. Two servings. Look at you. Nuts. No wonder I don't drink these things. 
on a normal day. Today is not normal. Today, I'll take the sugar. Need some energy. We're gonna keep on. We are uh, at mile 55. So we are knocking them out. We're gonna make it slowly but surely. Went through an unofficial aid station run by volunteers and picked up a rocket pop. It's good and cool. And uh, truck along. the worst of it. Almost there. One last push. And look at that. Barry and Brill are at the top. How awesome. No better sight. Hey. Yeah. yeah. We still gotta go. Well, the view off the mountain is something else, but this view right here, <laughs> this was worth the climb. Every step, Mama, car. every step city. was worth it. We're so proud, we love you so much. Go, Dad, go. <laughs> go, Dad, go. <laughs> So the race actually officially ends back at a brewery and pizza place down in Stone Mountain Village. So we gotta climb back down the mountain and run uh, about a half mile left back to the last aid station where there's pizza and beer waiting. We're at, uh, my watch says uh, 63 miles with uh, 4,300 feet of gain. And we are at 15 hours 15 minutes. We don't have far to go. See you at the end. Great Southern Endurance Run 2021. Almost putting this one in the books. Thank <laughs> you.